How's it going everybody? Midwest Pyrotechnics here tonight with a comparison and demo video. We're going to be demoing some ball shells tonight. So uh, what we've got here are some Mean Monkey Balls by Mean Monkey Fireworks. They are the same um, brand that produces these Zeus King of God shells. Very good quality shells. They have very good quality uh, fireworks in my opinion. I've shot a lot of them and I've shot a lot of these ball shells as well. These are fun. They're not too loud they have a nice they got nice symmetrical breaks to them they're real ball shells as you can see they they actually are wrapped and you know it's not the fake ones which i'll show you here in a minute what i'm talking about there but peeled back some of the red on this so um one thing i haven't done with these yet is actually see if the color on the wrapping matches up with what's going on out in the sky so we'll be doing that a little bit too um, it, the kit includes 129 breaks, which amounts to about 80 shells or so. I'll show you guys the box that this came in, um, some, somewhere in the video, I'll show you guys the box, but, uh, I got these at Wayne's world. Um, they're pretty good. I've always been impressed with them. They've got these multi breaks. I think this has four in it, but we'll, uh, we'll, we'll have to see when we shoot it. I can't remember exactly. Um, you know, these are all, these are all good quality, all good quality ball shells. And then we're going to compare it with this canister shell here just for fun and i also wanted to show you like i said a fake ball shell so these are just festival balls they're the cheap ones and they have the ball shape to it but inside i peeled back the foil and it's just like a mini canister you know it's got the clay top to it they're not very good they're cheap and they're fun to play around with but they're just, I don't know, they're not really, they're not really good quality ball shells. This is one of those as well. We're going to be comparing this with these real, this is a fake ball shell. We're going to compare it to the real ones and just show you guys what we're talking about there. So uh, with that being said, it's getting dark out. So let's get out there in the field and shoot some stuff off. One more thing, guys, before we get out there and going, I wanted to mention that I am starting up a Patreon page. So you guys will be able to go on there and support my channel more if you would like. There's extra content on there. Um, I'm still trying to get that all figured out, but you guys go and check that out. I really appreciate anything I get from you guys. Um, you know, you're the ones that make this happen, but also, you know, fireworks aren't free and, you know, I take any support I can get. You know, I'm still in college and I'm just trying to do this, you know, to entertain everybody and try to educate people about fireworks, get people into it. It's a lot of fun. And I really enjoy doing it, and I really enjoy uh, all the subscribers that I've gotten. You guys are awesome, and uh, I hope you guys will stick around and see what we have to offer here in the future. But like I said, you guys can go ahead and check that out. I'll talk a little bit more about that in the future, but um, I'll have the link to the Patreon account in my description. So please check that out if you would. I really appreciate it. And anything I get, like I said, will go back into fireworks. Um, I want to make as many videos as I can, and if I have the funding, I'll be able to do just about anything you guys want to do. If you guys want to request certain products that you'd like to see, um, certain 1.3 products, uh, just holler at me, and we can make that happen sometime. Um, like I said, but that stuff's pretty pricey, so I really could appreciate any support I can get, you know, any kind of financial support. So um, now we can get out there and shoot some stuff off. I just wanted to mention that real quick, guys. All right, guys, it's starting to get good and dark here. It's really, really cold out. It's about 25 degrees. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We've got this fake ball shell we're going to shoot off first to get a baseline here. So let's go ahead and load this up and get it shot. I'm just shooting everything out of a single mortar tonight. I'm not getting the rack out. Like I said, it's real cold. So here we go. Let's see this ball shell. I mean, it's loud, but they just don't do much. All right, here's the red one we kind of peeled back on. So let's see if this one's actually red. Here it goes. Get it dropped in there. Nice. All right, we're going to go ahead and try the purple one. That, that red one was nice. It had the nice tail on it. That's hard to find with the uh, 1.4 world, but let's try this purple one, see what it looks like. Didn't get very high, but we'll see if it does any better out of this old Excalibur tube here. Maybe it'll get some more height. Wow, not getting very high, but they have a good break. 
All right, you notice they have a good tail on them, which I really like, but they're not getting super high. I think that's due to the fact that I'm using the, uh, the canister shell tubes, which I think are a little bit bigger. These actually come with a, a, a paper cardboard tube, so that's probably why they're not getting to their maximum height. But uh, this is the light blue one. We'll go ahead and shoot it off. It looks like the colors have been pretty uh, consistent. Nice. If you notice, they got really good brakes on them. I mean, I'll give them that. They're pretty loud too, so let's try the yellow one here. Need to get a little further away here. Cool. All right, my hands are starting to get numb. So I'm gonna try to hurry this up. We've got the blue double brake. Let's see what this looks like. Cool. That had some blue in it. All right, here goes this big multi-brake one. So this ought to be pretty impressive. Let's, let's see what this looks like. If you had a bunch of these, it'd look really cool to put in a finale. So let's try this out. Try to get back from it if I can. Wow. All right, here's that uh, silver or that golden kind of canister shell looking thing. Let's see what this looks like. I'm pretty excited to see this. I haven't seen one in a while. It's so cold out here tonight, guys. My hands are so cold. That got way up there. That was awesome. All right, to top everything off, here goes a canister shell, red wave chrysanthemum. Well, everyone, that wraps it up for tonight, and I hope you guys enjoyed this demo of all these different ball shells and the canister shell there. Um, like I said, please check out that Patreon. There's going to be some good stuff there in the future. Still getting that all worked out, but uh, you guys can check it out anyway. Um, I've got a few videos uploaded on there if you want to look. Um, now, I, like I said, I appreciate any of the support you guys give me that's going to be able to help me buy more fireworks for you guys to see, and you guys will be able to request certain products that you want to see. Um, anything like that, you guys can just check that out. Uh, any questions or anything, drop them in the comments. Uh, but don't forget to like if you did. And we'll see you next time.